Is it possible to create an intersection point between a plane and an axis? Yes, it is. And in this video, I want to show you how. Hey guys, how are you doing? This is Simon from BizLearn. Hi, and welcome to a new NXCAD secrets tutorial. Is it a secret? Yes, it is for many of us. I believe also for me, I was researching once in order to create a relation between a plane and an axis. And by using the point, it was not possible. Point and point sets, by the way, are not enabled by default. So you will have to expand the construction group in order to get them displayed in this dropdown. But I need some more references in order to create the intersection point. And therefore, I will first of all create a plane. by using an angle value like here, which is fine, 45 degrees, and referencing one axis and one plane, then it's possible. I'm going to confirm and create a further plane by using a distance value of, let's say 100 millimeter. And my next step will be to create a datum axis. If OK is written between brackets, then just start the next command and the last recently used command will be confirmed automatically. I will use this plane and this point in order to create my datum axis. In standard uh, constructions, there is no use case for intersection points. Usually there are many other opportunities. For example, if you want to create a sketch on this plane, which I'm going to do, you only need to select the plane. Now you see there is a coordinate system displayed, sketch orientation, etc. But there's something you have to consider. I would just confirm this and now use reattach to check whether the references are well defined. So I'm going to reattach upon here, which is also not enabled by default. You will have to expand here in order to enable reattach. And by the way, one of the commands that I use as well as usually update model in order to update without leaving the sketch. So I'm going to open reattach and here you can see a plane is chosen. A sketch orientation is chosen associatively as well, but the sketch origin is fixed. So when having created this, the impression was that this point was projected, but it's not, it's fixed. So what you have to consider is to exchange, if you want this to be associated to your basic coordinate system, to exchange the method here by just selecting the point. And in terms of creating the sketch from scratch, which I'm going to perform now, it looks like this, select the plane and then exchange the point or define the point. You can see it's not displayed here. Select once. Now the point is projected. Everything's fine. So this is an opportunity to create an intersection point. One of the opportunities, but I wanted to find out whether it's possible to create an intersection point between the axis and this. Well, by using curve, line for example it would be possible very simple just select your starting point then use normal as an opportunity for the end point select the plane you now have to define the end limit which is value by default but it needs to be controlled by the plane distance so i'm going to use until selected select the plane now it's associated so now you have somehow an end point which you can use as an intersection point but that was not my intent. I wanted to find out whether it's possible to create an intersection point between an axis and a datum plane. Okay, let's find out. Let's use the point therefore. And the intersection point opportunity. And the only thing you've got to do to find out is not trial and error, you just need to read. You can see curve, surface or plane first. Curve to intersect with second. So let's select the plane first. Center mouse button to activate the curve selection. But this is not a curve. 
it's a datum axis. And once I was trying to create my first intersection point, I have realized that it's seemingly not possible because I need a line. So I've decided to create a line instead, but I have not researched with a point set. Let's do research here, point set. Let's find out whether it's possible by using point set to create an intersection point between an axis and a datum plane. Within the dropdown, there is an opportunity called intersection points. But points is not meaning that we need to create several intersection points. And within here, you can select plane first. You just have to read curve, face or plane. Send your mouse button to activate curve or axis. And within here, you can see it is possible to create an intersection point in an associated manner by using plane and the datum axis. You shouldn't give up when researching for opportunities that you may be remember from other CAD systems. There are sometimes opportunities more than you might think by just using slightly different commands, which in this case is the point set. I hope you like this video. I hope you have learned something. And maybe for those who have researched already, it's a cat secret that point set allows us to create intersection points between planes and axes. If you like this video, give it a thumb up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please feel free to subscribe. It also supports this channel a lot. And also don't forget to share if you like my content and talk to your colleagues. By the way, my cat secrets videos on YouTube are just representatives for the training material which I'm selling via my website. You can find the link below. Have a nice day. Goodbye.